So why, why am I a sweet briar in the first place, I think, is where I'd like to start. When I was interviewing for positions, um, there were two schools that needed someone with my expertise. Uh, one was a college in New England, which is where I was living at the time, and the other was Sweetbriar. So I went for interviews, as it turns out, exactly one week apart. And at the college in New England, the students asked me one or two questions. They took me to lunch, and I had to keep the conversation going. And uh, that, that was that. So I called my husband, and he said, how did it go? And I said, oh, it was nice. And then a week later, I came to Sweetbriar. And I gave the same talk. And the students asked me questions, and they asked me follow-up questions, and they asked me follow-up, follow-up questions. And then we went to lunch, and I think I got about two mouthfuls of my, of my sandwich because they were asking me so many questions that I spent all my time answering. And then the two students on the search committee took me for a separate half-hour interview and peppered me with more questions. So I got done, uh, went back and uh, called my husband and he said, how did it go? And I said, it was great. And he thought, oh my, I'm moving to Virginia. And we've been here ever since. Students at Sweetbriar are involved in every aspect of their education, um, from the committees to the social life. They're, they're in charge of um, all kinds of things. They have the leadership positions. Um, if something is bothering them, they let you know about it. They're not, they're not quiet. Um, in classes, they'll ask questions, they'll respond, um, so that you can have more of a, of a conversation with your students. Um, I especially like being able to do research with them. So I, I have students working with me right now who are testing potential anti-cancer agents made by other groups of students and looking to see if they have any activity against colon cancer or leukemia or uh, breast cancer. Um, and these are things that Sweet Bar students get to do because there's no one ahead of them in line. There are no graduate students, there are no postdocs that they have to seed e e equipment time to. Everything that we have here is for their use. And um, as a result, they get to do science. They are actually pushing back the frontiers of knowledge. Um, every semester, the biology seniors report on the work that they have done in their senior independent research. And it's, it's a marvelous thing to see. Um, I sit in the audience and I'm just so proud of them because they're talking about the work that they have done. And some of the presentations that they give rival what I've seen at scientific meetings. It's, it's a wonderful thing to, to see.